The movie's story begins with an ice kingdom, where penguins ruled. They were busy living their lives very comfortably. Suddenly one day, a very dangerous type of turtle monster, who had the superpower to bring out fire from his mouth, attacks this ice kingdom with his turtle army. His army was also very powerful like him, which defeated the penguin army of the ice kingdom in one second. Now, the monster went ahead and captured the remaining penguins, by putting the fire off his mouth and destroyed this big ice kingdom by melting it. After doing all this, he got a superpower called Star. Like in a game, you get power after passing a level. The story shifts to Mario Brothers, who have started their plumber job, but no one is happy with their work. Then they get a call. This was their first call. They have to go to repair the leakage from someone's house. Their fate does not support them. Their car also does not work. And when they walk and reach that house, they made a hundred mistakes in order to fix one mistake there. In order to escape from the dog of that house, they had ruined the whole bathroom. Now, the leakage was starting from everywhere. When they come home sadly, their family also taunts them differently. Mario gets worried and goes to his room, and then his brother brings food for him. We know that there is a lot of love in these brothers, because they have always been with each other. They believe that if these two stay together like this, they will never get into any trouble. Meanwhile, they hear the news and find out that there has been a huge leakage in the city's sewerage system. No one understands where the leakage is from. These two brothers think that this is the right time to show their talent. They both reach there without thinking. They jump into the sewerage and with a lot of effort, they find out where the problem was. But before they could fix it, the wheel breaks and there is a big blast of water, which took them to a different world. This colorful world took him to the second dimension of the earth. Mario reaches Mushroom Land, when he finds out that his brother has been separated, and he was stuck in a dark land. This dark land was of the same turtle monster, that we saw at the start of the movie. Mario's brother was very scared here. This place was just like hell. There was a lot of darkness, lava, and a lot of turtle skeletons. Everyone was after him, sometimes running, sometimes hiding. Mario's brother was saving his life. While here in the mushroom land, Mario sees a mushroom named Toad. He knew about humans. He found out that Mario came from the human world. While talking to him, Mario also tells him that his brother has gone to another dimension. The mushroom is scared and says, Oh, that's a dark land which is ruled by the turtle monster. No one can escape from there. If you want to save your brother, you will have to take the help of our princess, Mario, who wanted to save his brother, without thinking anything, and after walking behind this mushroom, passes through very strange blocks and tunnels, finally reaches a beautiful palace, but two small mushrooms stopped him from going inside the palace, Toad distracts these mushrooms, and finally, Mario reaches the palace, there was a meeting of the big people of the kingdom here, some mushrooms were telling the princess, that the turtle monster has destroyed the ice kingdom, the scene we saw at the beginning of the movie, they were talking about it here, and now we are going to be its next prey, this mushroom land was also in danger, here we see a princess who says, no, I will not let this happen, I will save my kingdom from that monster, even if I have to take the help of anyone for this, I will go to the monkeys to get help, then the princess also sees Mario here, whom the guards were trying to send him out of there, the princess stops him and listens to him, and when he tells the princess everything, and asks for help, then the princess tells him that, we both have the same enemy, if you have the courage, then you can also come with me to fight him, but before that, I will take a test from you, in a meanwhile, she makes a game level in front of him, while crossing it, he had to kill his enemy, that is, the turtle monster, and had to take the red flag from here, Mario does not understand what to do in this, then the princess plays the whole game for the first time, and teaches him what and how to do it, the princess did it all in a minute, because she had been doing all this since childhood, but Mario was not able to do anything, then the princess says that, to do this, you need energy, and you will get energy by eating mushrooms, he doesn't like mushrooms at all, but for his brother, he has to do this too, he eats mushrooms and then, tries to cross that game level, first time, second time, third time, now he was trying to cross this level for the hundredth time, but it was still unsuccessful, from evening to night, and from night to morning, but he didn't give up, he used to take a new mushroom every time, with a new energy, he tried to cross that level again, this time, he almost killed his enemy in this game, but then his little mistake defeats him this time too, 
But this time, the princess was not angry with his defeat. She says, I am happy. At least, you showed so much courage that you reached the last level. You fought all night. I am sure that you have a lot of courage. You will be able to support me. The scene cuts and we are shown the dark land, where the turtle monster sits on his strange throne and talks to his army and says, wow, you guys, did a great job, just like you finished the ice kingdom, now we will finish the mushroom kingdom, and the turtle says, no, but we can forgive them, if the mushroom land princess agrees to marry me, we find out that the turtle, likes the mushroom princess a lot, all the turtles support him, and the mushroom princess agrees to marry him, and then you both will rule all these kingdoms, to Mario and the mushroom princess, all the mushroom has come to drop them into a tunnel, while passing through this tunnel, they came out on a path where, there were a lot of things like a game, somewhere flowers, somewhere shortcut tunnels, somewhere there were small levels, after crossing them, any power is attained, the princess also gets a power, by touching it, her dress and she is completely changed, this dress has unique powers, Mario asks the princess that you are a human, then how did you come to the world of mushrooms, the princess says that when I was very young, I don't remember how I came to this tunnel, but then these mushrooms raised me, and now I take care of all this, she also asks Mario about the human world, she didn't remember anything about the human world, Mario says that the human world is very good, the princess asks if the turtles there, are also so dangerous and bad, Mario says no, no, the turtles there are so good, but people also keep turtles as pets in their homes, after the scene is cut, we are shown a dark land, where the turtle monster finds out that, there is a man with a mustache with the princess, now because he likes the princess, he doesn't like the fact that, there is someone else with the princess, he quickly comes to the kingdom and sees Mario's brother, he also had a mustaches, he thinks that this boy must have a connection with that man, he asks Mario's brother, do you know any other man with mustaches, who has come here and is with the princess, Mario's brother thought that he would be Mario, at first, he wanted to deny it, but when these people torture him a lot, he tells them that Mario is his brother, and maybe he will be with the princess, the turtle was even more angry about this, in this anger, he traps Mario's brother, in such a cage and hangs him, under which there is a lot of lava, Mario's brother sees that there were other cages around him, in these cages, the turtle has kept the imprisoned people, on the other hand, Mario, and the princess, had now reached the kingdom, where they met this monkey, a monkey comes to take them here, and very easily flies his bike, and brings them to the door of the kingdom, where there was a waterfall, as soon as they enter the kingdom, the princess asks the king for help, but the king refuses to help her by saying, why would I waste my army? Then the princess tells him, don't help us, but by doing this you will not be saved. Yesterday, the turtle monster spoiled the ice kingdom. Today, he is keeping his eyes on the mushroom land. After destroying us, he will come to you. Hearing this, the king also realizes that he should help someone in a difficult time. But he says, okay, I am ready to help. But for this you will have to prove that you are worthy of my help or not. He says that one of you will have to fight with my son, and if you win, then all my army is yours. Mario, who'd to go to the dark land to save his brother, agrees to him without thinking anything. The princess points to him that don't say this. The monkey is very dangerous, but now it was too late, and we were being shown the scene of the arena where the fight was about to begin. The princess thinks that Mario will definitely lose, but here the monkey king was not that bad. He had a lot of powers here to help Mario. Mario was trying to fight using those powers, but he was still very weak. In this fight, his job was that, sometimes he tricks the monkey by being so big, sometimes by being small, and he was beaten up by the monkey. But still, he did not give up. Now, he did not even have much power. He used the last power, and as soon as he used it, he became a very strong cat. He was having a lot of fun using these powers. He could also do big jumps. And finally using this power, he defeats the monkey after hitting him. Now, Mario had won. And with him, the whole army of the monkey, was now going to the dark land to fight that monster turtle. All those people were going to fight a battle where they first prepare and make their favorite cars. Someone had made a jeep or racing car here. After all this preparation, finally, they go to attack the dark land from a hidden road. The worst world they were going to attack. Its ways were much beautiful. On this way, that looks like a rainbow. Those people are moving forward while showing stunts. That suddenly they come to know that the turtle army has seen them and attacked them. The princess was thanking Mario that if it wasn't for them, the monkeys would never ask for their help. She also gets scared in all the situations, and then starts fighting them while 
while making herself conscious. Mario also gets down on another road to befool some turtles, but his car breaks down from here. He is about to fall down and the monkey saves him here. Those people were about to move forward to attack. That all the situation has changed. Where they had to defeat the turtles. The turtles have given them the tough time. Mario and Monkey have fallen into the water. Whom a huge fish ate them. As soon as the princess gets to know this. She knows that she can neither defeat the turtle monster. Nor save her mushroom land. Leaving everything behind. She comes to her kingdom. And tells everyone to vacate the kingdom. A strange chaos had taken place here. All the mushrooms had run away from here. Before the turtle monster came here. With his big ship and his big army. As soon as he enters, now to face him, the princess was standing alone with her mushroom. She was expecting that the turtle would come here and wreak havoc, but everything turned out to be the opposite. The turtle came to propose her. He asks her, will you marry me? Hearing this, the princess's anger touches the sky. She says, I want to die before marrying you. She clearly denies this. The turtle monster gets angry and says that you can't reject it. If you deny I'll destroy your mushroom land. If you want your mushroom land safe, then you should marry me. We will marry and make dark land and mushroom land friends, and we will always rule them. The princess had to agree to the turtle's proposal, unwillingly for her people's safety, and go to his land with the turtle. Their wedding preparations had begun. During all this, we learn the biggest truth, that the people about they think are dead. I, E Mario and Monkey were still alive in the fish's stomach, and were fighting with each other saying that it's your fault. Monkey punches the fish in the stomach in anger. As soon as he does this, the fish's mouth opens, and they also found a way out. They use their bikes to get out of the fish's mouth, and reach the princess. Mario learns that the princess is getting married to the turtle. The princess's special mushroom has brought a bouquet for her. The princess comes out with the bouquet. The turtle tells her with love that look, we are getting married. I will sacrifice all these people for this wedding. There was also Mario's brother in it. But here comes a twist in the story. The princess had agreed to marry, but she was not going to marry. She just made a trap for the turtle. The bouquet in her hand was actually not a bouquet but a power, because of which she changes her dress. And this dress gives her some frozen powers, because of which she had frozen the turtle. The princess also closes the machine with her frozen powers, which was putting all the imprisoned animals and people into the fire. The princess's powers were not so strong, that's why the monster turtle was going to free himself from the ice. When the other machine, was also free from the ice. Before Mario's brother falls into the fire, Mario remembers that he had played a lot of games, and he got some powers by playing those games. Using one of those powers, he becomes a flying bear, and he saves his brother. We get to know that all the monkey's army, who helped Mushroom Land, were captured by the monster turtle. The monkey who supports Mario, takes advantage of the situation, and saves all his friends. Here the ice of the turtle monster was also broken, it was a devastation. He tells all his army to get ready, and also tells his special man to go and get the machine, which will destroy this whole place. It was a big missile, and everyone was scared to see it. If it had fallen here, Mushroom Land would have been destroyed. Mario was in front of that missile to save Mushroom Land, but the missile was not even looking at him. While walking, Mario hits the missile's eye, and the missile follows him. Mario was now taken it to a tunnel, through which the missile would have reached another dimension, and the world here would have been saved, his plan could have worked, but suddenly everything changes, here the missile makes a big blast and the dimension ends, that includes the mushroom land and the dark land, everyone had reached the same city, from where Mario and his brother had come, even after coming to this world, that monster turtle did not give up, he wanted to kill everyone, he wanted to take his revenge on everyone. Here Mario and Mario's brother, were both fighting that monster turtle very confidently, because they knew that when they are together, then everything is fine. As soon as the monster turtle was about to burn Mario, then Mario's brother saves him from the fire. Mario says that if we get the power of a star, then we will be able to defeat this turtle very easily. Then he hears the voice of the princess from behind, that the star is right in front of you. The two brothers take the power of the star, and become very powerful. These two had now become super brothers, they had super powers in them. Using this, they fly, jump, punch someone, and fly someone in the air. They had defeated many of their enemies, and now it was the turn of the turtle monster, which they hold with both their feet, and turning him around, they make his condition worse. In the end, they flew him into the air. Before he comes down, the princess does magic on him, because of which he turns into a tiny turtle, and then he is packed in a glass box. It clearly meant that these two brothers, 
have defeated this turtle together. This magnificent bravery of these two brothers, and this magnificent fight was seen by the whole city. At the start, we learned that no one liked their work. Now all the people of the city had become their fans. Their dad also proudly calls them his son today. And from today, their lives change completely. These people have now started their work very confidently, which they used to do before, that is the task of the plumber. But not in this world, they work in another dimension, in the post credit scenes of the movie. Indeed, these brothers have defeated the turtle. The turtle monster is not dead but he is in prison. He can leave this prison at any time, and attack these people again. But since this is the end of this film, no one is worried about it. Thanks for watching.